Thank you. Where are you based? In Italy. Italy. All right. Yeah. Thank you for joining the live. What are you looking for? And um, tell us your age. Uh, what are your children? What kind of a relationship you're looking for? And when was the last relationship? Okay. Thank you very much. I've been following your videos and I love the way you love things. Oh, thank mm. you. Mm. Thank love you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, I'm 50, uh, a Nigerian man, staying in Italy. Okay. Uh, I am interested in uh, uh, a lady from 45 above that is staying in Italy, precisely. You no? Know? Uh, and I, and I just need that for a companionship. I, I have a family in Nigeria, but you know, being in Italy alone, I'm bored, lonely, and things like that, you know. So I just needed uh, a, a companion uh, of a lady who can actually keep me company. That's all. So, so if you say you've got a family in, in, in Nigeria, does it mean you've got a wife and children there? Yeah, yeah. So what I need is not what I I don't need what I need is not a wife but just a companion somebody who probably has given birth before who's a divorcee or something who is just for who is just interested in you know uh, keeping somebody company you know I'm just bored and uh, probably uh, uh, lonely that's just that's my problem yeah okay is there any reason why your family can't join you Mm, you know, for now it's not, it's not, it's not easy. We are working on it, but I think I don't think it's a one year, two years thing. You know, uh, and I spent about a uh, year plus here, and uh, it's not really easy. You know, staying alone. I'm not been, I'm not, I'm not used to staying alone. Uh, that's just the issue. Okay, from a from a woman point of view, I wouldn't support that, and I just feel for the other woman you you have lived in Nigeria, so um, I wouldn't uh, advise any woman here to 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 do that. But you, if you want, you can join dating sites. If there's anyone here who wants to join you, that's okay. But as for me, I I'm quite against that because you've got a with a wife and children, so it's very unfair for the woman and the children as well for you mm -hmm. to do that. So uh, what I would advise you is probably to bring your family over to you and then you know then be, be a family because no woman wants to have their time wasted okay uh, most women they want okay. relationships that last you wouldn't want to hang around and keep entertaining someone's husband why would a, a sensible woman do that okay why yeah yeah i actually that that's why i like to uh, put the cards on the on the table you know i didn't i wouldn't want uh, to you know to but i believe that there are some people women who equally might want not just a, a, a husband, but a companion. That's why I'm putting it close, yeah, and, and I, that's why I'm not hiding. That's why I'm not hiding my identity as a as a as a, as a completely married person. Because all I need that is just and uh, just a companion, not for marriage, not for just somebody who can keep me company. So if there if there's anybody like that, but if there's no no problems. Mm. Yeah, but I, I I wouldn't advise that. If there's someone here who wants who is who is looking, because people will look for different things. But as for me yeah. and the people that I try to encourage to find someone out advise them to completely stay away once you know okay. that someone has got a family whether the family is in another continent please guys stay away from it because you don't want to bond with someone's husband that disaster <laughs> you don't want to bond with someone's husband and this man is married so if you are going to be to try and play companionship with him that's when you would say oh he broke my heart. He didn't broke, break your heart. He's actually yeah. saying it. He's actually saying it that he just wants companionship. There's nothing attached. No strings attached. He's very clear here. If you go for it, you go for it at your own risk. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining the live. You're welcome. Okay. right guys <laughs> this is what you get and um this guy is, is a good example of men men tell us exactly what they want men say it he's honest enough he said it publicly and obviously if you if your wife if his wife is on live is on tiktok you will see this okay and you you say it doesn't matter it matters a man like this is something that one of the things that you should stay away <laughs> the minute they say i've got my family you have to run he has his family okay he said it because he values his family <laughs> he values his wife that's why he came publicly and say i have a woman 
Don't ever go there and say I'm going to change his mind because I'm very pretty. He's not going to change because he said it. He said it. Point blank, I've got my wife, my I've got another family, guys. You I won't blame him if another woman goes to him and say, I want to be in a relationship with him, I want to keep him company. You do it at your own risk. But this guy, I won't blame him at all because he said it. So you join at your own risk.